There was a special delivery at Akron Children's Hospital on February 20th. In honor of Lexi Barker's fifth birthday, the little girl from Alliance, who has been a cancer patient at the Showers Family Center for Childhood Cancer and Blood Disorders for two years, wanted to do a pajama drive. She appreciated a pair of soft pajamas she found on her hospital bed, which were much more comfortable than the hospital gowns. The family thought they'd collect 200 to 300 pajamas to take back to the hospital. But in about three weeks' time, they collected more than 1,800 pairs from all over the area and around the world. And they're just... Yeah, I can't lift up or I'll be on the ground. <laughs> Alright, Lexi did a pajama drive for her birthday for all her friends at the hospital. And we've collected... 1,880... Thank you. We were at 1,878 pajamas this morning, 26 robes, 298 pairs of slippers, and then $775 in cash, which we used to buy totes and storage bags so that everything could be organized for them. And this is wow. in like three weeks? Yes. yes. And tell me why, why did you do this? Why did we do it? Because the robes, you don't like the, what well, don't you like up here to wear? The gowns. You don't the like the gowns. The gowns. <laughs> Are they itchy or they're just not comfy? They're not comfy. Okay. <laughs> well, I heard, too fashionable either. I heard you, when you got here, you, you had a pair of pajamas and you thought that was cool, is that right? And so you thought that you should grab a, collect a couple pajamas? <laughs> a lot. A lot. Well, certainly the fact that so many people have gotten involved to help support the patients going through treatment for cancer and blood disorders is important. Every little bit helps. And we really, you know, we want them to feel at home. We want them to feel comfortable. And pajamas is one way to do that. And we have recently made some requirements uh, to help reduce infections in our immunocompromised patients, and that's that the pajamas have to change every day. And so often, families don't have that many changes of PJs, and sometimes they're brought in on an emergent basis, so they don't have time to pack you know, a suitcase just full of pajamas together. So I think we have enough now that probably every patient can change daily without any problem at all. Um, Mom and Dad, you said that this is, I mean, these, these donations are from all over the world? Mm -hmm. Yeah. How, uh, where? Um, she's England, got Ireland, from... Hawaii, all over the states. So just every day packages have been arriving packages. and at different drop-off places. Absolutely. And yeah. they're still coming? Yes. They're still coming. I'm okay. so sorry. <laughs> they're still coming. We will figure it out. <laughs> Thank you so much. Happy birthday. <laughs>